Hi guys, I'm back with another, another review. <laughs> um, finally, I've got round to re-reviewing uh, these guys. This is Smolder and Dispensor. Now, um, these guys, it's Ironhide um, on your left and uh, Rewind, is it? Um, just down here, um, which are the Combiner Wars Ironhide and the Titans Return um, uh, Rewind, sorry. And basically what they've done is uh, the guys over at um, Repro Labels have produced a sticker set for both of these guys which you can then upgrade them and change them into these toys. I did do a review of them previously but unfortunately um, the review got corrupted somehow and it kind of goes halfway through and then starts going all weird so this is me reshooting the video for you. Okay, so uh, first up, um, we'll have a look at Dispensal. You see side by side, they look pretty neat. Um, I'll have a look at Dispensal first of all. So um, if you don't know uh, Dispensal, um, he's um, featured in the Transformers first movie towards the end, where the AllSpark um, comes in contact with loads of different um, objects, machinery, and turns them into Transformers, and one of which is a Mountain Dew um, vending machine dispenser unit. And uh, this is kind of a, an update on him. I think there is an official uh, dispenser Transformer, which was, um, I think it was out last year sometime, which was 2016. I'm trying to think what he was. He was, I think he was a, like a, um, a truck, green truck um, that changed into a robot. With this here you've got loads of different stickers here so you've got the Mountain Dew stickers on the front here round to the side you've got close up if you see you've got like a, a jaw sort of green sticker on the front here and there are a couple of stickers which I haven't added which I found too tricky two side pieces here um, stickers that go around the side here fit on nicely um, you get Mountain Dew on the front here you even got sticker that rolls around the gun here as well and on the feet here as well and even stuff on the back here so you can see the little pictures of the kind of fizzy drinks on the side there Bring that up. so you can see all of that there you go everything on there um, and you obviously get all the articulation is exactly the same um, the only one I find a little bit tricky is the mouth one so I don't think that looks all that great um, if I was going to potentially I guess what you could do is actually just um, take that one off and paint that a little bit green which I might do um, I'll see because there's teeth in it you can't really see it looks like I've got like a slight blemish on the um, on the thing there either that or there's like a hair or something that's caught on underneath and you can see that just the side there um, but yeah, he's pretty cool. Um, there are a few stickers which I didn't apply, but most of all, they're all done. So that's him in robot mode. I'll have a look at Smolder now. Um, now, I have added a, a different head to this one, which came courtesy of a, a guy that I spoke to on Facebook, uh, Rich Potter, and he's got a kind of sales page, um, which I can pop the link to down below. And he does kind of... Um, kind of reproduction kind of heads and accessories and things like that which are um, all very nice and at a reasonable price if you want to check that out and I think that looks pretty decent with them as well the um, sticker set does come with stickers to improve the iron hide head which you I think got black stickers on the top and things like this but this looks uh, very good kind of menacing I think I really like it, it makes it look like a completely different uh, transformer you've got uh, these stickers on the front here which kind of catch the light very nicely. Blue stickers all down here. Um, even stickers on the combiner port here and on here. Um, stickers on the legs here. There are a few that I didn't add, I think, which are around here as well. And then a view from the back and around the side there. See, I made a bit of a mess adding the windshield sticker here. One, see where it's got a slight tear in it. It doesn't show up too badly. But uh, I think he looks pretty decent. I'm really pleased with the head as well. I think if you are going to get it, it's worth getting hold of that if you can do as well. It's uh, really good quality. And uh, then you've got the sword, uh, the axe here as well, which has got stickers on either side as well. What I'll do is um, I'll get them all transformed and you can have a look at them 
in the alt modes um, and then we'll and then you can see all the stickers on there as well so I'll just uh, stop this and then we'll pick up from where we left off